Hello Makeup Lovers, welcome back. Mi bellezas, bienvenidas. Thank you for joining me. In today's video, I bring you a huge haul with beautiful makeup. We have Christian Dior, House Silage, we have Chanel, Sephora. But before we start with this video, please don't forget to subscribe if you have not. It's free. And hit the little notification bell so you get notified every time I post videos like this. If you like and enjoy luxury makeup, I am your channel. We love luxury makeup in this channel. Without further ado, let's get into it. Let me start with this beautiful How of Silage lipstick. I never seen anything more beautiful than this. They are a company that really produce what they make its perfume but also have this exquisite line of lipsticks it's something to admire and it comes in this beautiful package it's just a lipstick case i purchased both the lipstick case and the lipstick now you probably have seen it all over social media these lipstick cases um, are limited edition, at least this one. And the one I pick is Whispers of Admiration. Look at this beautiful, elegant lipstick. I never ever seen anything so beautiful. Put a, the case has a mirror inside. And I'm gonna show you the lipstick. If you already haven't seen it on my Instagram page, the Whisper of Admiration Bow Lifted Case is finished in highest quality enamel and precious metal encrusted with over 300 brilliant diamond cut Swarovski crystal. These lipsticks are very expensive, $225. I purchased mine off the Nima Marcus website and I mean, they are very, very expensive. The case that is worth it. Think about all the Swarovski crystals encrusted on that enamel case. It's so beautiful, exquisite and elegant. Uh, I remember my mother many, many years ago using those type of cases and I kept some myself because at the time they were coming back many many years ago and I love them I think it's very practical nothing quite like this which is super super elegant but it's something to look at and if you are a makeup collector I'm sure that you're going to love it because it's absolutely beautiful and exquisite now for the refill lipstick, which you can add as many colors as you want with just one case, and they have other cases, but uh, Whispers of Admiration lipstick case, this one is a limited edition. They have others too, but I picked only one. I have the lipstick refill in color Duchess. I really like it, it's very soft. It's like a balm on the lips very nourishing and moisturizer to the lips. Now moving to something else, I'm going to show you this mask contour, eye contour from Sisley, and I love it. Oh my God, I got it of Saks, and I saw it just by pure luck, looking for the Sisley foundation. This is what happened. I ordered three shades that I thought would fit me, but Sadly, they didn't, I had to send them back. I only opened two because I knew the last one was gonna be too dark, but I'm gonna keep trying. I go to the store, test it, so I can review it for you and let you know just in case you are on the market for that specific foundation. But this eye mask, you just add a little, little tiny bit on top of your makeup, underneath, and it's an instant, I left. It's fantastic. It feels wonderful on the eyes. Great, great. I love it. But don't use too much. Just use a little bit if you're going to wear it under your makeup. 
Now, um, moving to foundation, continuing with foundation. Let me show you, which by the way, I'm not, I have so much stuff, I don't have any specific order here. I have the La Mer foundation. I finally got it, yes. But before I plunge and pull the trigger, I tested three different colors. And my color is amber, I love it. And I'm going to do a review on this foundation, so stay tuned on the lookout for this because I really like this foundation. It's beautiful for many years, for a long time. I didn't test it because I didn't think they would have a color to suit my complexion, but this one color, Amber, yes, Amber 53, it's a perfect, perfect match. I also got the powder. I tested this foundation for a week, uh, straight, every single day, just to make sure it wouldn't break me out or be not good. Let me show you the translucent powder I got. And these ones are medium deep 42. That's how it looks. And I will have a video for you ladies and gentlemen pretty soon on these ones. Now let me show you another foundation. <laughs> And this one I've been testing too, but I've been testing just the samples. This one I got for many, many years. It's still loaded double wear. A stay in place makeup foundation was for me like all times foundation. It was full coverage. It's not the foundation I really like for my skin. But when I tested, because a friend of mine told me, you have to test it, you gotta test it. You're going to love it. She was right. And I do a video on this foundation. The only thing is that I do not use um, a brush. You gotta use your fingers and then your sponge, which I really dislike to use my fingers. But it's the right application for this foundation if you like sheer coverage or sheer to medium coverage. It's a very good foundation. I was, oh my God, really, really happy with the results. Still loaded double wear. Now, um, moving to Tom Ford, I purchased the 04 Sable Voil translucent powder. And yes, it has these compact translucent powders. And I ordered mine off of Beauty Leash because I placed an order with a VIB sale from Sephora, and they only have three of these colors. And I ordered the darkest, which was Dusk desert dust or something like that and it was still too light for my complexion and if you are lighter than my complexion you would like that translucent powder but this one is looks like this and it comes with the brush number four and i got it off a beauty leash website they had the four colors for the deepest complexion and I'm gonna give it a try because I am preparing a special video for you guys only wearing using Tom Ford. Everything Tom Ford, from brushes to cosmetics, and I was missing that powder. Now we have it. Um, let's see, let's move to his. I also picked these two of a beauty leash. This beautiful, no, I got them from Sephora. And these are their cream and powder eye color eyeshadow and golden peach. And here's how they look. It's a peachy look like with rose gold. Beautiful. I love it. I really, really like it. It's so, so <gasps> to die for. Really, it's a beautiful cream eyeshadow. And when you apply the powder on top, it's even more beautiful. For night time, you can add, see? It's really a beautiful cream eyeshadow that stays put in place and won't budge. And then this is how the powder on top of the eyeshadow looks. I'm gonna add a little bit. But I'll make a video using these beautiful eyeshadows because they are really worth to see and have. And I don't think you're gonna finish them anytime soon. Just make sure that you keep the, the cover. Here's how the color looks on this one. 
that way the cream and shadow will not um, dry now this one the other one I picked is the naked bronze finally I got it and this is how it looks I'm gonna have a little bit here on the back of my hand to show you and don't worry I make videos with everything I just wanted to share this mini haul with you see it's so so beautiful I will add a little bit of a powder on top as well and that's how it looks look at the reflection and it's not a glitter that's gonna stop traffic it's very subtle and very elegant I also got my hands from Saks Fifth Avenue on three of the beautiful Shantekai eyeshadows and as you all know they are proud supporters of different foundations that help conserve um, animals that are in instinct now we have here I pick up only three they are very pricey very expensive and do not worry I will leave everything linked down below for your convenience as I always do so you can click on it and see prices and colors of everything I'm wearing two of these eyeshadows right now on my eyes and the one I'm wearing is the giraffe that looks like this it's a beautiful really an extraordinary brownish bronze deep bronze color and I have it on the outside on the outer V of my eyes and of course the lion I love lions I'm a Leo and look at this color too I really really love it it's these colors for me are out of my alley <laughs> I love them and of course that this is the pangolin which is a beautiful look at the art it's just to die for each one of them see have the picture of the animal on the cover but Shantekai is absolutely beautiful I have a few things from them this is the color of the pangolin by the way let me show it to you finally and it's beautiful I'm gonna show you colors of how they look wet and dry because they, I'm wearing the formula right now wet and here's how the colors look on the left side of each color we have the wet eyeshadow and on the right side the dry we have pangolin giraffe and lion now moving on to lip glosses i finally got my hands on the emily gordon lip balm they are so beautiful i got two of this they are beautiful i have heard so much of her but i never gave it a try i don't know why they come in this beautiful box and look how luxurious it is look at the case it's like modern but at the same time very clean cut i love it and it has like an off even though it's a modern um case minimalist it has like all times english look on the of the case it's absolutely beautiful it smells so good and this one is in flavor rose imperial that's how it looks imperial look it's plastic both of them is not glass this is how it looks it's wonderful it feels great on the lips i just gave it a little taste um i got it yesterday and we have this one it's the one I tested before I apply my lipstick and this is in color Charlotte they both smell very subtle like a strawberry I would say that's the smell there now we also have two of the new Christian Dior liquid lipsticks and I'm wearing right now the 999 on my lips as you see it's a beautiful red on deeper skin like mine it looks kind of like orange i apply it just to film this video it's beautiful i got this too and i'm gonna show you the other one which is color 
um, hmm, 760 Dior Red. And this is how the colors look. I love the applicator. Wow. The applicator of these liquid lipsticks, look at the shape. Perfectly, I mean, aligned to apply the lipstick on your lips. Really makes it easier. It's like an arrow. That way, when you apply the lipstick, I mean, you can line your lipsticks with this applicator. And this is the red one. It's so beautiful and comfortable, very nourishing. It does not dry your lips. This is how the color looks. The two colors, absolutely beautiful. I am in love. I really like them both very much. And I only got these two colors because I wanted to test the formula. I wanted to test these lipsticks and see how they felt on the lips. I know they are Dior and I love Dior. I'm a huge fan and I have and wear a lot of Dior. But when it comes to liquid lipsticks, especially matte, that's a different story. I'm more careful. And I also pick up these two colors because I can match them and like wear the red, the darkest, on the outside and the pink one in the inside. It looks very, very beautiful. I like them both. Absolutely. Yes. We're almost done, I promise. Now let's move to Chanel. And from Chanel, I got something that I was holding myself for a very long time. And I finally got the one that I think will be good for my complexion. And this is the Palette Essential Concealer Highlighter Lip and Cheek Color in color 185 Caramel. And it's this one. You see? You can use the concealer. It's really too dark for my under eyes. But for the face, it's, it's a good color. I'm going to show you. I don't know if you will be able to see it. I'll do a video reviewing this palette because if it's good, I would like to recommend it for those of you who travel and need to simplify your makeup bag. I also have that for the future, how to pack for a business trip and for vacation. I think that even though we have beautiful makeup, we want to take everything, we have to simplify our makeup bags. Now let me show you, this is how the, okay, the concealer, you can hardly look at the color on my hand, but let me see if you can see right now, yeah, the highlighter is beautiful. And the color that you can use on your cheeks and on your lips and even on your eyes is more of a orange color right here. I hope you can see it. I also have um, Le Cream Main Texture and this is the hand cream from Chanel that I purchased and I'm gonna show you. Looks like that. It has a beautiful scent, not overwhelming. Very, very nice. I love it. Ah, it's so good. I really, really love it. It's a delicious hand cream that is supposed to make your hands and your nails it's supposed to nourish them i really like this hand cream it's beautiful i really really love it it doesn't feel pasty on your hands or greasy it has the perfect scent but it won't fight your perf your body perfume your perfume is really really nice i really like it and highly recommend it it's really good and with this my beautiful makeup lovers Mi bellezas. We completed this video. I hope you enjoy it. You like it and have fun going through this video and the talk. And maybe you can pick one or two items of the whole haul. Don't forget to leave me your comments and questions below. I always love to hear from you. And if you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you on my next one. Thanks so much for watching.